I definitely will adapt that I love, love, love the dresses and the drawstring, which is commercially great because it's one size fits all pretty much. Season to season, I definitely want to um, develop clothing, develop pieces for the women, rather than be you know very conceptual with it or anything like that. It's, it's going to be a constant development. This year, the judges were really, really pleased. Um, it's a different process uh, for entering the competition, so we've got a different level of designer this year. Uh, most of them have started businesses, um, so it's not about discovering a new talent, it's about pushing that talent forward into business. And I think we've, we've seen five very, 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 uh, not only creatively talented people, but people that are sort of committed to their business, which is what we wanted to do, um, swing this with a very, very strong business um, angle. I relate it to electricity. As you can see, the, the power lines and the, the electrical clouds in the prints of the fabric. At the end of the day, um, gosh, a different panel, you might have a different winner, but I think uh, we did a very democratic way of kind of judging. I use this as a stencil um, for all of my garments as an organic print because I want to use a method that was not going to be harmful to nature. The essence of what we found today and, and my brief to the judges was really find that person who you want to keep watching. You want to watch their career develop, you want to see more from them. We found a winner tonight that is very, very well deserving um, of this prize. Well, this suit was actually inspired by the Renault Media.